Well, for me, draft day was a lot different than it is now. There was no, you can follow it on MLB Network. In fact, both of my parents were at work. I had just got done with my senior year in high school. Then Mike Bassett sees a pitch he likes and sits on it, a three-run homer, interrupting the JV soccer game. I'm at home and I know the draft is happening, but there's no way to follow it. It's 1996, we didn't have internet at home. So I'm just waiting for the phone to ring. So I'm getting kind of more nervous and more disappointed. Finally, the phone rings. It's the Cleveland Indians. And I believe it was in the sixth round. And they said, will you take this? And without even thinking, I just doubled the offer. And I said, hey, just give me double and, and let's go. And they said, we can't do that. They hung up the phone. And I got a call later, hey, you've been drafted in the 18th round by the Cleveland Indians. A week later, the Cleveland Indians come to my house and they're trying to sign me. I'm pretty sure I'm not going to sign. I've kind of made up my mind over the last four or five days that I didn't get drafted where I wanted to go. I'm going to go to college. My dad has a good friend. Tom Grease pretty much put it to me, it's time to make a decision. Do you want to play pro baseball and, and go after the dream of being a major leaguer or do you want to go to college and put this off? I want to go play in the major leagues. We go back into the room. My dad, somewhat acting as my agent, now knows that I want to sign. And we end up at 1 a.m. coming up with a deal that works. My dad wanted me to sleep on it. So as they left, I talked to my dad and my dad said, look, this is one of the biggest decisions that you have to make in your life. And I don't want to make that decision for you because I don't want you to look back on this decision and look at me or look at your mother or look at somebody else and say, I wish you would have told me to do this. You're going to have to make this decision on your own. I decided to sign the professional contract with the Cleveland Indians and I'm glad that my mother and father had me make that decision instead of them telling me what to do in that moment. And it all ended up uh, working out pretty good. Don't know what would have happened if I went to Texas Tech, but it's one of those decisions that you live with and I'm, I'm really excited and happy that I got to make it to the major league.